Bome Andrell sent me. Said you could use these genetic samples to repopulate the Shanjaru. What? Let me see them. These samples are amazingly detailed. I don't know who you are, but you've saved an entire species from extinction. Well, you should rename them after me. Interesting notion. I'll, uh, recommend it to the Galactic Species Preservation Society. I'll start working on these samples immediately. Thank you for delivering them. Alderaan certainly is the prettiest world on our itinerary. Don't let all that breathtaking scenery fool you, though. This is the most dangerous planet of the core worlds. The nobles here could teach the Sith a few things about backstabbing and assassination. Great. A planet of two-faced killers. They say every noble who's anyone has killed at least one person, even if by accident. Every so often, the noble families spill their bloodlines fighting for the throne. The current succession war is the bloodiest on record. Since the Empire arrived to put its own puppet in charge, there's no telling who will come out on top. Local politics put me to sleep. What's our business here? Your first delivery is a piece of glaze cake. All you have to do is escort that antique power droid to House Organa's castle. Since House Organa runs this spaceport and their castle is right around the corner, dropping off the droid should be a quick run. Got any info on House Organa? They like to present themselves as the good guys, but they're pretty shrewd politically. You won't be dealing with them, though. The droid belongs to a couple of young nobles, Len Teron and his sister Sidonia. Decent people, all things considered. Got it. I better get moving. You made a deal with a woman named Risha for this droid? I'm here to collect. Welcome home, you ugly little thing. I mean the droid, of course. This is no time for your juvenile jokes. We should properly introduce ourselves. I am Lady Sidonia Teron, Herald of the Gold Aurora. And I'm her brother, Lord Len Teron, Warden of the Eternal Flame. Please call me Len. You're the best thing I've seen all day, Len. The last time a woman made me blush, I was just a boy. My brother and I are all that remains of House Teron's noble bloodline. One of Alderaan's more reprehensible pedigrees, House Bailis, slaughtered our family and seized all our holdings. If that happened to me, I'd be raising an army. Hard to raise much of anything when you haven't two credits to rub together. This droid holds new hope for us, literally. Centuries ago, our ancestors hid something inside it for safekeeping. Pirates absconded with the unfashionable machine generations ago. Tracking it down has consumed our family since before we were born. What that droid contains will rebuild House Turan. But we need instructions to safely open the hidden compartment. It's rigged to explode, Whoa. you see. The instructions are at our family's estate, now occupied by House Bayless's forces. Without those instructions, we can't pay you. Are you looking to hire me? You're obviously talented at acquiring things. The instructions we need are in a data pad of Tehran family history at our estate's library. If you retrieve that data pad, we'll add a substantial bonus to your payment. And there are some additional family heirlooms we'll pay you handsomely to recover while you're there. What kind of security does your estate have? Hard to say. I'm sure Bayless installed new systems after we fled. Sidonia, it's almost time for that meeting with House Organa. Why don't you go chat with them in my place? How shocking that you'd rather stay and entertain a female guest. Very well. I'll return as soon as I'm able. Don't hurry back. Goodbye. I thought she'd never leave. My dear sister has the charisma of a killick. You, on the other hand, are endlessly charming. Just give me and his lordship a few minutes. Fascinating friend you have there. I'm gratified he trusts me with you. When you return with that data pad, I'll have to find a creative means of thanking you. I've already thought of several. Really? I look forward to comparing notes. When this droid business is over, I might leave Alderaan, finally put the blood and feuding behind me. Spend the rest of my life as a galactic vagabond, 
Wouldn't that be grand? If you're looking to roam the galaxy, we should talk when I get back. I hope we'll do more than talk. I've monopolized your time enough for now. Do take care of yourself. Rumors are filling the hollow frequencies of a daring robbery at our old estate. You've set a lot of tongues wagging. How's Bayless is missing a data pad from their new library? I'll let my dear sister have the honors. Never could decipher that blasted thing. It's a simple code, woven through the genealogical entries. You just have to assemble the letters correctly, Len. I'm sure Len's just being modest, Sidonia. Yes, modesty is one of his most famous qualities. It's true. Everyone says so. According to this, we must pry open the droid's ventral servo motor housing and disable its lateral conduits. The hollow chip is hidden within a false power storage unit behind a detonite charge, entering the disarm code. I've got it! After all these centuries, we finally have our proof. The information on this hollow chip proves House Turan is owed a considerable number of credits. When the other families hear of this, we will reclaim our status among the nobility. All that from a little holochip. It's shocking what they can fit on those things. I must leave at once to have this data authenticated by the Royal Council. Len, see to our hero's payment. Nothing would please me more, dear sister. <laughs> We'll go tree climbing after we get paid. <laughs> yes, well, you clearly have a pressing schedule, so I won't impose. Here, take this data pad to your associate Risha. It contains one of House Turan's old family recipes. The design for a powerful anti-radiation shield, which makes a starship immune to all sorts of nasty cosmic rays. That could come in handy. I can't imagine what you'd need something like that for, but I'm sure whatever it is will be quite exciting. You have House Turan's deepest thanks. Someday you'll have powerful friends on Alderaan. Farewell.